Hi, this is a uh, this is an extension cord I got out of a vacuum cleaner, and people throw away tons of vacuum cleaners. Um, vacuum cleaners almost always are clogged. Like if you just take the time to pull the screws out and take it all apart, you can usually get a hanger up in there and pull out the clog and clean the filter. Um, clean the filter in a solution of water with a little bit of bleach in it, and that will kill any mold or bacteria spores that bacteria or mold spores that are in there. But anyway, uh, a lot of uh, the lower the the vacuums have these recoiling cords in them. And if you have one that has that recoiling cord, you can uh, just I attached a little extension cord um, female receptor to the end and just put silicone over it so you know to keep it insulated and then uh, you know you can pull it out uh, this is probably 30 or 40 feet and then you just pull this little tab here and it uh, it winds back up now I like this for the weight because my other option is this gigantic cord that I can't fit in my tool bag and it's weight it's always too long and it's always too thick and uh, for most small stuff, I mean, even with a drill, you know, all you need is a 15 amp cord, so it works really good. Now, I thought I'd show you this other thing that's pretty neat. If you, uh, if you have an LG, which is the compact washer and dryer under cabinet models, and your pump goes bad, um, if you pull that pump apart very carefully, you can get these really cool uh, cylindrical magnets out of them. I have two so far. Uh, one of them I broke while taking it out as you can see, but uh, if you want to magnetize a screwdriver tip, a uh, cylindrical magnet is great for that because you take the screwdriver tip and you just, you know, <laughs> do a little humpy humpy and, uh, and it, it magnetizes them great, you know, just a few times across like that every couple weeks or something. Now the other magnets I wanted to show you is, uh, these magnets here are out of a magnetron. So if you find a microwave, somebody discards a microwave, pull it apart, be very careful of the capacitor in there, discharge that uh, with something that's insulated, an insulated crappy screwdriver or something, because uh, it has a pretty good charge on it. But these magnets are embedded in uh, both sides of the magnetron, and they're pretty, pretty strong magnets. As you can see here, that is about four inches up, and uh, it's, it'll hover at about four inches. So. I mean, it's a pretty strong magnet, so and they're pretty cool. So it's good to have for tools and stuff. And uh, I think the only other thing I want to show you is um, I use a backpack for a for my tool bin. Um, it holds a lot of tools, and uh, I don't know if you can see in there, but I keep all my different tools in there. It keeps them separated well, and it's also easier to carry on my shoulder than it is to carry a, a bag of tools to my side. So uh, that's worked out pretty good for me. Alrighty, that's all for now. Have a good one.